I wanna show you the world through my eyes Show you the colors in my mind Quasque <laughs> Vou a sua melhor babá. 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 There is this reason of urbanization. Many people are moving from villages, they are coming this way, living in town. And once they reach here, they don't do enough and extraneous jobs. So they become fat, they become less, they don't do anything that can at least burn their fat. After some years, then they develop diabetes. When I joined these services, we had very small amount of patients coming. But nowadays, we have registered about 11,000 patients here at Temeke. Many of them, or 90% of them, they are type 2. When I started the clinic, we had one room. Uh, as time goes on, we just get the partners from WDF who came in to just support the services, whereby the, the good clinic and the building was constructed. Now the services are good. We are called Sakunta Clinic at a school. Faidika, Kikuba and Faidika, Napata Mongozo, Wakuishi. Nafanya kazi kwa kweli na penda kliniki ya kisukari kwa sababu tunawapa elimu ya kutosha tunawaelekeza kama wanashida mbalimbali mahali pa kwenda Hapana. Ila shida ya kisukari ni shida ndiyo, lakini shida sawa na shida zingine. Previously, uh, we had no NCD and diabetic clinics. Now we have 169 clinics. This is very, very big achievement. Not only clinic with equipment, but also training for health, health providers in terms of management of diabetic and other non-communicable diseases.
the burden of care and treatment is on the increase. And uh, we look at what are the risk factors for non-communicable diseases. Most of them, they are lifestyle related that they can be modified. After is implementing the National Diabetes Prevention School Health Program. Basically, the program is aiming at prevention of diabetes among the communities and also among school children. So we are educating the children on NCD prevention so that the children can also educate communities about NCD prevention. It's my personal interest to see communities educated about NCD prevention. There are simple strategies that can be put in place and save the lives of many people who are dying due to lack of knowledge about NCD prevention. Ule ushauri nitaweza. Kwa sababu na mimi ki kuugua, nataka niwe na amani nzuri. Na afya nzuri. Kwa sababu siku hizi nimeshaanza na kuchoka, nikitembea na choka fulani. Kwa hiyo nitafata kama nilivyoambiwa. Sikuna These young children, they are the leaders, the leaders and the adults tomorrow. So I'm looking forward for a healthy nation in future because now they understand about these risk factors and how to live a healthy lifestyle. And this will actually impact them, even their children. So we are looking forward for a healthy generation to come. Another country should come to Tanzania to learn how, how the program is, 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 is performing. It's a wonderful program.